Good afternoon, YouTube. This is Green and My Tears coming to you on Green TV, also known as Katrina. So today I'm going to be doing a, how do I, I don't want to say haul, but I just want to um show and tell. Show. So I'm going to be showing you fabrics that I've obtained recently on eBay and some other areas, not on other locations, not on the internet. So without further ado, um, I've been looking at a lot of fabric and looking at sergers on ebay and um yeah so my guilty pleasure is fabric oh my gosh i love fabric but without further ado um all the fabrics you're about to see are all 100 percent cotton fabrics they range from a, a um, fat quarter and a fat quarter is 18 to 24 18 to 22 inches or in metrics they have if i'm not mistaken 20 to 24 inches that's in metric in the metric um measurements but, um, yeah, so the first three are from, I bought from eBay. So this is the, one of the, the um, fabrics that I just recently obtained. And this is the Amy Butler Lotus Wallflower Sky. And this is a half a yard of fabric. And I like the print on this. And what I'm in the process of doing is rebuilding my website. So what you see currently on my website, I'll leave the information for my, my current website on the, um, in the information box. But I'm going to be uploading a lot of new products. So this is some of the fabrics I'm going to be using on part of the new products. And this is another piece of fabric. I really like this one. The colors are vibrant in what it says. And this is by Michael, I mean, excuse me, Robert Kaufman. And this is called The Chef's Choice. And it has different types of... Um, coffee like cappuccino, mocha, mocha latte, espresso. So yeah, I like this fabric. Haven't decided on what I'm gonna make and put it on my website as far as these particular fabrics, but I just want to come and show you the my um my new fabric collection. And also we just cleaned up our house and I put all my cotton fabric together, all my knits, all the wovens and I have a buck a, um, container with all my scraps and remnants, a container for all the batting and interfacing, and even a container for um, upcycling fab upcycling items. Like we buy sweaters, jeans, you name it from the thrift store, and we don't necessarily use it right away, or we buy it to wear it, and we decide we don't want to wear it. We want to do something else with it, so we keep it and put it in that container. So. I'm trying to keep our, us more organized. When I mean us, I mean my daughter picture me lovely. So, yeah. So, now I bought this fabric. It's um, a bill, excuse me, Michael Miller. And it's five yards of seven pieces between, like I said, a, a fat quarter and a yard. So, these is, I got this today. So, I'm going to show you the colors. So, I got this small. And this is all polka dot fabric. So this is a small polka dot fabric. And this looks like it's about, I don't even know, I haven't measured it. But she put it up on there, she posted it on there. But yeah, I won the bid for it. And this one is brown with pink polka dots. Then we have this pink polka dot. No, no, pink with white polka dots. And then we have a sky blue with the white polka dots. And of course, you can't be, you can't go wrong without black. Can't go wrong with black, black with white polka dots. And this is red, a red piece with black with white polka dots. And this is all Robert Kaufman fabrics. Oh, I'll take that back. This is a, um, that that red piece was a Robert Kaufman. And this one is a Michael Miller. But, and these are the people that I'm talking about in these particular fabrics. This particular batch, these are people that I, um, textile designers I like. So, Robert Kaufman, um, Michael Miller, and Amy Butler. I really like their fabrics. So, those are fabrics I recently obtained from, from eBay. So, this is some the fabrics I'm about to show you now. I'm going to tell you where I got these from. So, these two pieces I got from, and they are so cute. Because I'm going to make a, a dish mat with this. And this is, I don't know if, it looks like it's stars, but it's actually forks and knives. 
I mean, forks and spoons. And I thought that was so cute. And I don't know who this is by. Let me see if the name of this person is on here. It's called um, Lizzie Dish by Lizzie House for Andover Fabrics. So, yeah, that's that piece. And the coordinating piece, I got to go with this particular piece of fabric. And I got this from Stone Mountain Daughters here in the Bay Area. And this is the coordinating fabric for that. And see, it has a fork. And then there's one with a spoon right here. So it coordinates with this fabric. So I plan on making a dish mat because um, the house is small. So I try to um, leave out enough space on the countertop so I don't have a dish mat rack I have a dish mat so I'm after we wash dishes or after dishes dry we move that and we still have space thus the dish mat so this is going to be made out of a dish mat from my house now these pieces are from new pieces this is a fat quarter I didn't open it up because I'm not going to open it because I had it in my stash so this piece is from from new pieces this this is from new pieces and this is from new pieces I wanted to buy like a yard of this but I didn't really like it like that to enough to buy a yard so I got the fat quarter and this piece is from new pieces and new pieces is in Berkeley California and this is another piece I got from new pieces okay so the next piece is a fabric I've obtained, excuse me, are from from Joanne's in various locations. And this because I like wine, and a couple of my um, gurus on YouTube like wine. Um, yeah, so look out something from your girl. You know who you are. If you don't, you better ask yourself. But yeah, I like this fabric. And this is at least two yards of fabric. I'm not sure. But usually when I see something I like, I buy no less than a yard of fabric. And this, I got this from Joann's. I like these different, these contrast and polka dots. And I got these. This is two different pieces. And I was going to make a handbag out of this. And I still might and sell it on my website. So this is turquoise with, with um, gold. I like this fabric. See, I have a good eye for fabrics. And this to match that. So what I do is when I buy something that's to, that I'm going to work using the same color palette, I put them together like so, so I know. So that's that. And then I got this from Joann's. And this is a cotton fabric, but I like the rainbow effect in this. And it's really nice fabric. And like I said, it's 100% cotton. And I think, I'm not sure, but I got this to go with this. I'm not sure, but it doesn't look like I did, but I don't know. But I like it. And I got this one because I love me some butterflies. So, yep. That's that. And then, for the Hello Kitty fan and myself and all of you ladies and gentlemen out there, this is like semi my Hello Kitty collection. I didn't want to give you all my collection, so... I only showing you three pieces, but this is one Hello Kitty fabric, and what I did with a piece of this is I made my hanky that I carry in my purse out of this Hello Kitty fabric, and this is a Hello Kitty fabric, and of course I got blue because I like blue, but yeah, that's a blue Hello Kitty fabric, and this one I really adore. Oh my gosh, I adore this Hello Kitty fabric. Look at this, and I got at least two yards, two or two and a half. Yeah, you guys are this fabric. I really like this one. I, my intention was to make myself some pajama pants out of this fabric, but I have someone that's possibly going to be make want me to make them a bag, one of the bags that they've seen on my YouTube channel here. So I'm not going to use this until I know what she if she wants me to use this fabric or another fabric. And then uh, I really like this fabric too. I have a lot of I like a lot of different fabrics. For the cook in me, this fabric is how let me see what this called. I think it's called <laughs> what is it called? Oh, it doesn't have it. Oh, anyway. 
But this has all it has words of different spices. It has like allspice, um, nutmeg, sugar, thyme, tarragon, pepper, garlic, rosemary. So I like this fabric. So what I might do using with this fabric on my website, I'll probably make aprons or pot holders or something of that nature for the kitchen. So yeah, I like that fabric. And last but not least, another wine fabric. And this one, it just has words on it. And it says Merlot, Vin Blanc, Garlic, uh, um, Resiline, Spanish, Olive. So this is more like a cooking and wine fabric. I like this fabric. And this one is called um, Vintage Wine wine varieties but yeah i like this fabric so that's all the fabrics i've recently obtained since 2013 well 2013 beginning this year and majority of this i got last year i'm gonna say november from november to to now and also i want to show you this book that i recently obtained um Aprons, and this is something I'm going to also be putting on my website. Is this aprons, and this has this book has several different aprons in it that I'm going to be making, and I'm going to be selling on my website. Like for example, let me show you one I really like, and I have some ideas that I want to make up that I've thought about for myself. And it's funny because. I cook and I don't necessarily use an apron, but I'm starting to make myself use aprons because I'm not a, a sloppy cook, but you know, sometimes you do wipe your hands. So this is something that I want to put on my website and sell. I don't know what how much I would sell it for. It all depends on how much fabric and how much detail I put into that item. And then also some of the items that I'll be host, uh, posting on my website, I'm going to have them where you can, I can customize them. So, um... That's it for my show and tell fabric collection that I've bought thus far for 2013. I really don't need to buy any more fabric because the cotton container that I have is full of fabric already and I want to start using it. And I know that me getting my website up and running correctly and efficiently will help me to get rid of some of that fabric so I can be able to replenish and, yes, be able to um, sell, sell, sell. So if you have any questions, feel free to give me um, a PM or hit me on my website so I'll leave all the information in the, in the description box below so don't forget to comment rate subscribe know that God loves you and be encouraged have a blessed day